Hey, I'm Michael Crane, council member for District 3, City of Fort Worth. We're here at RISE Community Center today, and I'm here with Court Director William Rumley. And we're going to have a Court in the Communities event on January 20th from 9 to 12. Can you tell us more about it? We're excited, Council Member Crane, to be here, and we're doing what's called Warrant Forgiveness Court in the Community. We're a safe harbor court, so we won't be arresting anybody if they have warrants with us. It is from 9 to noon. It is a walk-up only, so we need folks to get here. We'll take the first 120 that show up and have cases with us. What type and of person should be here? Come. Anybody who has a citation with the City of Fort Worth Municipal Court, okay. if you have something with another jurisdiction like Arlington or Tarrant County or something, or that White wouldn't be us. White Settlement, which is right there across the street. Yes, sir. Yeah. It wouldn't be us, but anything with Fort Worth Municipal Court, okay. uh, come on down. We do ask that you bring your identification of some type, but you'll come down. We'll have three judges here and staff, what? and they'll see folks related to their cases. What, what type of cases should people bring here? So it's any citation. Okay. It can be anywhere from traffic to, we do have some non-traffic, as we refer to them, it's like assault and things like that. And also ordinance cases. It could be a dog off a leash or something like that. Any type of court case with us. So basically what we want people to do is come here and not be scared to go to our municipal court to get their problem resolved. We want them to get back out there, et cetera, and not have this ticket problem anymore. Absolutely. And so we call it warrant forgiveness. And where the forgiveness comes in is that, A, there's no arrest. They're coming on their own volition voluntarily. We want to help them. Secondly, that they may be eligible for fees to be waived, warrant fees, collection fees, that type of thing. So it can take down the overall cost and we'll look at options. Maybe uh, they need community service or something else rather than paying. So whatever we can do to facilitate getting their cases resolved, we want to take those barriers away, like their license being blocked or not being able to rent because of warrants. Okay, that's a great service that we're gonna offer to folks. Um, I think it's important because we want people to be proactive and active members of the community. Yes, Sometimes sir. these problems stop them from doing it and, and cause more financial burden or other burdens that we want them to be able to, to live. Yes, right? absolutely. Yeah. And we'll have other services here as well. We will have Goodwill North Texas will be here. Great. We will have North Texas Legal Aid here. Okay. And then also the Envision Center will be here. So there's all types of other services just besides us. Okay. So they can call us 817-392-6700 okay. or go to our website. It might be underneath here too. Yeah, absolutely. Right, might put it right here. Yes, sir. Fort Worth, Texas. Um, dot gov and they can go look on there and go to municipal court there you go and uh, what if they can't come on uh, January 20th from 9 to 12 is there another way they could have this conversation about warrant forgiveness absolutely so we actually do this type of thing every day at the courthouse so at 1000 Throckmorton Monday through Friday 8 to 5 they can contact the court and set up a time to come see a judge the other option is we do have a satellite location at Vivian J Lincoln yeah, Library yeah, which is close to us and so beautiful they can, library absolutely yeah. so we do have a service location there Tuesday through Saturday from 9 to 6. They can go see someone. Uh, they can see a judge actually on Tuesday afternoons and Thursday mornings. That's great. Well, I'll say this. If you haven't been to this community center, Rise Community Center, come check it out. If you can't come to uh, the Warrant Forgiveness, there are other opportunities. What we want to make sure is that every citizen, every resident of Fort Worth can be productive. And sometimes we understand there are issues or problems that stop them from doing that. And so I'm really appreciative of this service, of what we're doing, and really getting out in the community. That's the whole idea of being in the community, of the, we're helping people that need it. Absolutely. We're very excited to be here, and we thank L LVT Rise for allowing us to be here. That's great. Thank you very much. Thanks for being here. And y'all show up. If you have any other issues or problems, please let us know how we can help. Happy to do it. Thank y'all.